what's up guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be doing here an awesome opening of the dragonoid ultra plus magma blast the baku gear set this is definitely really fun of course because right off the bat i could already see it has 900 b power that's definitely going to be really awesome but at the same time we also have here the baku case this one is for chaos this is going to be exciting as well because of the fact that so far i have the ventus and the darkest cases so to actually get the baku case for uh, uh, Chaos as well, definitely quite nice. And of course, we're also getting a backer gun, Gortheon, and we're also getting the backer cores and the cards, of course. So that's going to be really fun. But of course, without further ado, let's just get this all opened up. Alrighty, so now that we have everything opened up, let's take a really good look at all of these. This is definitely very exciting, of course. Here's the back of the case. It looks really nice. I love the actual silver here that distinguishes itself from the actual translucent color of this. So definitely quite nice. And of course, we know by the back, of course, as well, that it has its uh, similar thing. You could actually clip these on to another one. So you could actually have two of the cases together. And uh, yeah, that would definitely be quite convenient. But of course, let's open it up. So we have these over here and you simply just open it up just like so of course you have these of course to put in your back gun just like this here's our Gortheon which is definitely quite nice so hopefully I can get this opened up. Okay, so here is our Gortheon, definitely quite nice of course, but of course we also get the cards, and wow, it's actually in here, nice. So we're just going to peel this open, and we're going to take a look what's inside. So we can obviously see that we have our Gortheon card, unfortunately we're only getting Gortheon. That's the sad thing, we don't get any other ability cards or anything, so I'm quite disappointed in that sense, but hey, we only get one of these, so that's fine, you won't get any of the additional languages, but... 200 B power, 7 damage, not particularly great, however, if you actually have a particular card that can switch them and make you win on the damage, then that would be quite nice, but Gortheon has 2 green fists. Again, not the most uh, best thing ever, but these are what they are. I mean, that one is not too bad, but this one is, it's alright, I mean, it's not too amazing. But yeah, these are the old designs for the uh, actual... Uh, back of course, so that's not too bad and we're going to take this and open it up wow that was just awesome the way it flipped open like so but uh yeah there we go here's gortheon as you can see his b power right there uh this one seems to be a bit more on the simple side of things but hey you're getting this out of a baku case so what do you really expect you know so i'm going to try and close this up doesn't seem to be too difficult i mean yeah that's really simple but simply just slip him in like that and you'll be fine or you can put him in like that and this part here is kind of like a compartment to put in your back cores or of course a compartment to put your cards as well so up to you on how you want to do it but i'm going to put my gorthy on right here and uh, i keep these in a separate place anyway because i have so many of them by, by now so yeah uh, let's actually just close this up and now let's actually take a look at our dragonoid so firstly we have the back of cores we have here a uh, shield and we also have fire fist definitely very nice as you can see here 200 b power minus two damage and five damage wow and oh actually that's minus two energy that's interesting so a lot of these new symbols i'm not familiar with here these two particular ones i'm pointing at yeah very interesting gonna be uh quite fun to actually see what they can actually do but i'm assuming it has something to do with the gears of course but with that being said let's take a look at our dragonoid himself absolutely stunning absolutely amazing that just looks really cool and this is a pyrus dragonoid as well so it wouldn't be right if he wasn't actually a pyrus bakugan you know definitely really awesome the 900 b power meaning it's going to be very strong so that's quite amazing but uh yeah now that we have actually taken a good look let's see if we could actually uh take the back 
the battle gear actually. So we have all of these. This looks like some kind of fire wind wings or something like that. I don't know. It's very interesting, of course. But yeah, I mean, it looks like it's just going to attach on like so. So definitely quite nice. I believe it's right here. I'm actually going to attempt it right now. Right. Like, I think it's like that. Yeah, it, it kind of acts as like missiles. So that's definitely quite interesting. Let me just see if I can uh, put this in. Definitely be careful on how you do this because you don't want to be damaging them, you know. But yeah, it kind of looks like missiles, you know. Like, you attach it like that. It looks pretty cool. You could actually readjust it if you want as well. But yeah, definitely looking really awesome, really nice. That looks pretty cool. And now we actually have the Baku gear itself here. This is definitely quite a unique design for how they actually made a Baku gear loving the pyro symbol right here but it seems like look at that so it has that there so it seems like we push this open like so and we should be able to oh that's awesome so it just comes out like that so in some sort of way we can attach this on i believe it's right over here is it i don't know like i really want to figure this out obviously but uh, right now i do seem to be quite confused as to how they actually would be doing it because I see some interesting notches somewhere, but I don't know. I mean, how is this actually going to go on? That is definitely really weird here. Perhaps like this, maybe? I don't know. How does this actually go on? Well, actually, before I actually do that, let's actually take a look at all of these cards here because they're definitely quite interesting things. So firstly, we're going to take a look. Uh, we got Paru Hammer. It's our Baku gear, definitely very nice. So this is actually a hammer, wow. And over here we also have that it gives 100 B power and also 12 damage. Wow, that's amazing actually. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's good. But six energy, wow, that's quite costly. Uh, of course, we also have our Dragonoid Ultra. I mean, if it's an Ultra, it means it's gonna bounce when it actually uh, opens up. 2 damage and 900 B power, absolutely amazing, can't believe it, but uh, oh, here's some actual information, so firstly, we've seen these before, it's kind of like the guide on how to actually understand the game, but over here we have this, so maybe we could get some information on how to actually put in the back gun, and the cores, or the gears, right, maybe, I don't know, no, this is actually just how to close it up, and a bit of extra information there that we don't really need to care about so i don't know i'm trying to figure out how to actually do this but wow we actually also don't get any back cores as well but hey do oh no we did get back cores but uh yeah it's going to be quite interesting to see how i can actually figure this out all right so i kind of figured out how this actually works so these actually don't go on the top here you're meant to actually put it from the bottom and uh basically how this works is you take these like so and you simply are going to slip them into it from the bottom. Hopefully I can get this in. Hold on a second. There we go. Something like this, yeah? And these wings actually kind of partially open up as well, which is quite nice, of course. So let me just get this other one in as well, and that would be quite awesome. But yeah, these are, these are pretty cool. It basically comes out like that, so it looks a lot better that way. It's a bit more neat. And the way this actually works is, believe it or not, the top part here is a magnet. And it just snaps on like that. That's absolutely amazing. And this is what you get. You get this really awesome, I guess, uh, I don't know, really cool dragonoid with a cannon on top here. And of course, you get this as well, which is absolutely stunning. I love it. Everything about this just looks really amazing. Of course, the legs here, you could also just pry out as well quite a bit. And this will kind of give it the full effect. So this is everything just all opened up. Definitely looks fantastic. I absolutely love it. I can't wait to actually get the other ones here for the back of gears. Uh, I definitely love it. I mean, you could easily just take this out, snap it back on again. Very amazing. Uh, very innovative, actually. So you simply just put this together again. And that's it. It's quite nice. It's all done. 
And when you do that and snap it on, it actually opens up on its own, which is absolutely amazing. So yeah, this is definitely quite fun, definitely quite interesting. So tell me what your thoughts are about all of these Bakugan. Do you guys actually like these? If so, definitely drop a like and also share this video as well. This is definitely just a really awesome thing that's uh, been done for Bakugan now. So definitely quite a bit of an improvement. Uh, yeah. Let me know your thoughts guys, also subscribe for more videos just like this, but in the meantime I hope you all have a fantastic day, I'll see you all next time.